What up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with more Demon Slayer. Feels great saying that. Super excited to be hopping into season four. Remember, for those of you guys who don't know, some of you guys are aware, but the first and last episode of every season of every show we do on the channel, the full length version, which is normally a Patreon exclusive, is available for free for everyone. So click that link in the top of the description. Enjoy that free full length. Come back here for the review when you're done. And if you like that format, want to keep it for the rest of the shows, rest of the movies, whatever we got on the channel, check out that Patreon. Links are down below, like always. We're also live on Twitch watching this. It's always a vibe watching this with you guys live. Twitch.tv slash Darius. Come on and leave a follow. Hang out. Like I said, it's a vibe. If you guys don't mind, follow me on my social medias, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Much, much appreciated. Not going to waste any more time. Demon Slayer, Season 4, Episode 1. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, here we go. A UFO Table production. They're two of the hotheads of the Hashira, but I've wanted to see Obanai and Sanami fight for a very, very, very long time. So I'm very eager to watch this. Ooh, the amount of demons there are too. So beautifully handled. I love the green tracer on his blade and the purple on open eyes. I love how flowy his knife is like a snake. I love how they are just struggling to handle a couple of them. Meanwhile, these Hashira are just handling like nobody's business. a tornado of slashes claws purifying wind the music going crazy right now with open eye right behind him all right orochimaru relax buddy a coil choke i love the way they animate that serpent breathing is so sick Just a literal vortex of slashes. Ooh, as it rains demon blood on him. Alright, Mikasa, relax. The Infinity Castle? Oh, I love the way they're animating this. Oh my god. Door's gonna close. It's gonna be some. Yep. Oh my god. Such a broken ability. I need to know about Muzan's fucking right hand woman who be playing that bitch. What the hell? At least they saved the woman, but. <laughs> Talk about an introduction to season four. So we're definitely post Swordsmith Village. The news have been. Has definitely been out. Able to defeat two upper ranks. Nezuko conquered the sun. That's the craziest thing to think about. I love the symbolism as the sun starts to get shaded. Yep, the shading starting to come in. The darkness is on the horizon. Both physically and metaphorically. Yome, the stone Hashira. ライディアマネ。山根が務めさせていただき、愛を出ることが不可能となったもの。心が終わりもちだ。わあ、ネバーアピアアゲン。おお。That's I don't want to pause it, but I always love how good power scaling. That's not even power scaling because it's not power. How good respect scaling the show is when it comes to how insubordinate, how hot headed, how crazy these guys are outside of the Demon Slayer corpse. And then you uh, when it comes to Master Kage and stuff like that, they just turn into the most humble, most respectful people 
on this planet because of how much they care about him. And it really goes a long way of showing how much he's earned their respect, you know? Yep. Yes, indeed. We got some marks. Love their birds. You know, Tanjiro's got his mark as well. This is more sun breathing, though. Tanjiro was the first during season two. Now we have two more during season three. And they were, you know, okay, okay, we need more. Yes, sir. I love how he turns to the camera like we're talking about him. So this is the training that the Hashiras are going to be undergoing in this arc. It's all trying to develop that mark. Interesting, interesting. I'm curious. そう he really says nothing. He's really just about his business, you know? You've never seen Gyomai do anything. Okay, buddy. Okay. Have we not gotten Zenitsu's reaction to Nezuko being in the sunlight permanently? <laughs> he just loves getting some attention. Some love, you know. This is the craziest development Zenitsu's ever had. With the welcome home, too. <laughs> She's still learning, but it's all good. <laughs> Zenitsu's gonna be the most heartbroken. Shout out Zenitsu. That is so funny. So, Inosuke, the guy who can't get Tanjiro's name ever. And Nezuko can't get his name. And then Tanjiro just only wants more food. He is fat. This is going to be an interesting season. This is going to be a crazy season, that's for sure. That's our main swordsmith boy. What's up, buddy? Got any updates for us? What, black? Oh, black like usual. It looks fire though. I love the I love the sword. It's an even deeper shade of pitch of black. I'm saying they are hilarious. 
けたけどすごい人だな今日はかなり穏やかで awfully mild that is hilarious is that genya yeah もう済んだから騒がしくて悪かった <laughs> that would that's literally me. I'm literally Ganya. There's so many loud people I know 24-7. I would that would be me a hundred percent. I've dwindled considerably as they're gathering their forces ready to take her. I like that. I like that reasoning. Raise the bar for the Demon Slayer Corps as a whole, you know. Okay, Guillaume, I respect it. Alright, we don't have Giyu. I'm very curious how he's going to be training. But this should still be a fire arc. I'm definitely ready for it. Retired Hashira? Urokadaki? Tengen? Oh, every Hashira one by one. I love that. I'm here for it. There are some times I'm like that, like people that are overly positive, you know, optimistic. But I'm never like this. Zenitsu's wild. That is hilarious. Oh, for us thinking of him, yep, when you use the lightning style. Thunder breathing, whatever. Still see the bite marks on his head. Hey, you were instrumental in helping us in that last fight. So <laughs> now he's all happy. He's got to butter him up sometimes. Then he's was hilarious. He still got the drippiest outfit, in my opinion, with the kimono matching his hair. I love it. Look at this gangster looking. He's even got the bedazzled eye patch. Come on. He's such a legend, bro. The current active. Oh, still got his women. Ooh! Got the soup, the onigiri, the beautiful women. If Tengen is saying it like this, and he does seem one of the more easygoing Hashira of them, so I fully agree with him, you know? Rapid movement training for Muichiro, okay. Flexibility training from Mitsuri. That's the one I want to do. And it's Obanai. Some sword skills. Okay. Sanami. Infinite slashing tra training. Hey, man. It's, it's so great just having you here, my friend. Infinite slashing. They're going through some hellish training. I love it. I forget the name of the birds because they all have their own like they have like a title they go by but i love how each individual hashira and demon slayer's birds are so different what's going on with my man giyu
I'm glad he's grateful. Lady Amane seems like a very kind and caring woman. I just hope we don't lose Kaguya too soon, man. He's one of the pieces that hold the Demon Core, Demon Slayer Core together, you know? Is that Yushiro and Tamayo? Tamayo Shinobu collab, I'm down. I like how Tamayo has been like an official third party, not on either side technically, but it is crazy to think about. You're the second demon to the go to the headquarters besides Nezuko, you know? Was that not the, that was the entire first episode? Oh, wow. All right, so that was our introduction to season four of Demon Slayer. I am loving the concept that because Muzan has finally discovered his goal of conquering the sun, aka Nezuko, that he's gathering his forces, gonna do a little bit, of, I don't think they're training, but just gathering his units, getting everything ready for whatever sort of all out offensive he's gonna do on the headquarters or on Nezuko. But because of how little demons are attacking in this one moment in all of demon history this is the first chance we've had to gather our units as well and actually collectively train them to not only increase their strength but the strength of the hashira and the core as a whole so i'm really liking the reasoning and the concept it's not just a typical training arc that you can just train whenever there's a specific reason for it really enjoy that really am enjoying nezuko being in the sun talking to zenitsu inosuke we got Genya, who's kind of a part of this main squad now, especially after last season. So I'm super down. Um, really intrigued with the Hashira, how they interact with each other. Giyu being so isolated. I need to know more. I feel super bad for Kaguya because he is such a cool guy, such a great leader. There's a lot going on. There's a lot that's going to happen in the season. It's only going to be eight episodes. That was one of eight. That pisses me off, but I understand it. Super excited. Also super nervous. Um... I'm very ready. That's all I can say, though. If you were, if you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like on this. Let me know your thoughts down below in that comment section. Please subscribe. Click that bell. Check out that Patreon if you guys want the full uncuts for anything else we do on the channel. Um, come on over to Twitch. Watch these live with us week by week. It's going to be a great time. We're going to be caught up. We're going to be, it's going to be a great time. Trust me. We're going to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Because you never know when Deep Muzan's going to come after him. Have a great day after squad. Peace out.